Hi guys, welcome back to the A Plus Show. This is your girl, A Plus Bond, and I am coming to do a haul on some beauty items that I recently got. Um, I love these items. I'm so happy that I like just broke down and went ahead and got the items and stopped just watching everybody else enjoy their items. Each one of these items I really, really love. And so I can't wait to show you guys what I've gotten. Some of the products I am wearing, so yeah, kudos to me for going ahead and try, trying out some of my products. I just was so excited that I couldn't wait. And if I'm talking a little funny, it's because I have my retainers in, so I apologize in advance. But let's go ahead and get started. And you know I'm just pulling stuff. I'm not going in any order. The first item I got was a fragrance. I was looking for like a new fragrance um, to start wearing. And so I picked up this Elizabeth James in Nirvana. I really, really love this, the smell. It doesn't have a floral smell at all, and I was trying to get away from that. It's a very mature smell, not isolated. I said, look, are the old people picking up this um, fragrance? Because I don't want what the old people are picking up. She was like, no. So I went ahead and got it, and I love the way it smells. However, it doesn't last. It does not linger on my body. It doesn't, like, mesh with my skin. So... I haven't gotten any compliments on it like I like nothing nobody smells me <laughs> so I don't really really like that um and it was pretty pricey so I'm like wow that kind of sucks so while I do love the way that this smells if I don't start getting some compliments soon I will never purchase this again but I absolutely love the bottle it's so super cute but it just doesn't produce what I'm looking for I got my little Sephora bag All right. All right. So next, I picked up some more of my Samantha lashes. This is Huda Beauty. I absolutely love these lashes. This is in um, Samantha number no. seven. I don't purchase any other um, styles from her. Not to say that I don't like them, but the Samantha really, really works for me. Right now, I'm not wearing any lashes, but um, I like to save these for very, very special occasions. And um, you can wear these like. 10 15 times before you dispose of them so they're well worth the uh, price point so yeah you can find these at Sephora or you can find them on her actual website and these are just number sevens and they're called Samantha okay I also picked up I needed a new brow pencil and I decided to go with the lighter color so I picked up a number three I've been using the same pencil in a number four I have a lot of dark uh, powders and some other pencils that are like around the number four or darker so I was like well let me get this in a lighter color so I can blend them all together so I really really like that I the pencil is like so easy to use they have this one is the one with the fine point you can also use the one with the wider and more angled tip that one is easy to use as well but I will tell you that um who is this Too Faced or Benefit I'm sorry Benefit did their thing when they came out with uh their brow collection I have like three different ones and I love all of them the only thing that kind of like makes me like one more than the other it's just depending on what color i'm feeling at the time but right now i'm feeling number three so i have a number three in this brow pencil and i absolutely love it i didn't purchase these there were just some samples added to my pack and i don't know what this is oh this is the eye makeup re remover white and this one is um ultra repair cream mm. I don't know, maybe some hand lotion or something. Alright, so next <coughs> next thing I um, recently purchased was this palette by Carly Bible. Um, oh my gosh, I have been asleep on this. This has been out for a while. You can get it from BH Cosmetics. And I was just like, oh, I don't need that. And I don't know who video I was watching. And I was like, oh my gosh, I need that. I looked at it. It was very, very affordable. And I was like, okay, let me get it. I absolutely love it. It's 21 color eyeshadows and highlighters. Um, they like are so shimmery. And if you beauties have been following me, you know I just love sh shimmer. And I love bronzy brownish colors. Like that's my go-to. That's my thing. So it has the mirror up here. And then this is what the palette looks like. All of these colors are just like super, super gorgeous. These down here I use as highlights. Um... I'm wearing this one here today. It's a little subtle, but uh, on my eyes, I'm wearing this 
here on my lid and then I blended it out with this one and this one okay you see this palette isn't this like bomb you guys like aren't these like they're so shimmery like all of them shimmer except for one two three four five six seven eight okay it's eight things on here that do not shimmer everything else shimmers i love sparkly stuff uh oh i don't want to get my fingers in it and just look at the designs that they put on these highlighters down here it's just so gorgeous so yes oh one thing that i noticed is when i opened the package like it smelled good i was like well when did makeup started smelling good like it just it had like a scent to it so that might irritate some people but they are so creamy oh my gosh it glides on so smooth it, it picks up on your brush so smooth and creamy absolutely love it um i did notice um it's easy to get some fallout especially you know when you're picking it up so be careful with that and make sure you tap off your brush so you won't make a mess so um other than that, I have no complaints whatsoever about this here product. Okay, I knew I had got something else. Also, with my point from Sephora, I picked up this. I've been, like, wanting this fragrance for a while now. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's M-I-U, M-I-U, or whatever. And um, I decided to get a sample of it instead of purchasing it because it's pretty expensive to see if I like it. I really, really like it. I, like, walked through the mall, sprayed it on before, like, months ago. I really like it then. Um, so I'm trying not for a second time because I don't want the same mistake to happen with this one that happened with the Elizabeth James one. So, yeah, I'm still trying this out. It's in my purse. That's why it's not in this box, but I did get this. Okay, so the next product I've been like checking, 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 waiting, 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 and then it finally came, and I was super stoked. If you guys follow me on Snapchat, which is A Plus Blonde, you have, would have seen this already, but here it is. Okay, so I'm never, I don't follow Kylie. I think I follow her now, but before this, I didn't follow her. I wasn't subscribed to her newsletter. I didn't know anything about it. I started watching people's videos or Snapchats, and I'm like, oh, okay, I like news, and they looking real nice. So I went ahead. When I went the first time, they were sold out, and I went back, and they had them in stock. So I was like, okay. So I love the way it's packaged. You see that? And then all this here cushion, like, it's like, very important. And then it comes with a card. It says, hi, guys. Hey, guys. I hope you love the KKW slash Kylie collab. I'm so excited for you to try my four fave news. Have a surprise coming soon. Loves and kisses. X and O's, whatever. Kim Kardashian West. Okay. So then you pull it out, and this is what it looks like. It's just gorgeous. It's box is just so gorgeous you can just like see it sitting up on your makeup counter just like looking all cute and stuff and the colors are these are cream liquid um lipsticks it's kimberly kim kiki and kimmy okay so slide this apart and oh my gosh isn't that gorgeous so if you lose the other part you can just still like have it like posted up just like this and it'll be just just still superb um i swatched out uh gosh this first one here which is kimberly i believe yes um but today right now i am wearing kiki and i hope i'm pronouncing it right but i don't know what else it could be other than kiki i pronounced i'm wearing kiki and i paired it with the mary Kay um lip liner in soft blush very light lip liner and then here you have Oh, I'm sorry. I'm skipping. I am wearing Kim, not Kiki. This is Kim. So this is what I'm wearing now. And this is Kiki. And then the last one is Kimmy. This one here. So yes, I'm definitely going to do some swatches and a try on for you beauties, but just not right now. But I did want to come and show you that I have received them. I'm so excited. I know you guys have probably seen a thousand videos on this, but watch mine too. Make it a thousand and one. I absolutely love it. I love um, the two that I tried on thus far, the two lighter ones. Um, this one here, what is it? I'm gonna forget. Kimberly, and it's just like it's so just like naturally new. I, I absolutely love it. I'm sure my husband will be like, "What? It's nothing on your lips." 
you know, they don't understand. These are definitely for true nude lovers. If you love nudes, this is a great palette. If you just kind of fool with nudes every now and then, you won't be excited about this palette or what the colors look like on you because they're nudes. So these are her favorite nudes and these colors are all nudes. You can see I'm wearing one and it is very nudish. I'm sure you could pair it with the, like certain liners to kind of bring more color to it, but in its natural states, they're very sheery, nudie looking kids. Alright, so that is it for my cosmetics haul. Thank you guys for watching my channel. And until next time, bye.